Hi Canon Follow fans, it's Raz coming from Cardiff. Um, this video will be coming uh, two days after the match against Liverpool and will be featured the match before we play against Liverpool <laughs> in the Carabao Cup. Oh jeez, what a... It's a bitter pill to swallow. The thing with me is that I've got quite a few Liverpool fans where I work. Um, and being an Arsenal fan, very few. You have to roll with the punches. Anyway, we get into the post-match report after these titles. Okay, so Liverpool three, Arsenal one. Now I I worked all yesterday. Um, I only got to see some of the highlights, but. From what I've been hearing um, on the, the online, it seemed as if sorry, it seems as if we um, yeah I'm a bit choked. <laughs> it seems as if um, we had chances. I saw um, Alexander Lacazette score one um, way 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 before this. Way before this, um, the game could have changed a lot quicker if um, Mane's attack on. <laughs> On T Kieran Tierney was looked at. Um, he said it was his shoulder or something, and um, it was a, a back fist or a back elbow to Tierney's face. All I can say about VAR is that it doesn't work. It doesn't work for Arsenal players. Um, I, I'm trying to remember the last time we actually got away with a VAR. Um, maybe it was. It was uh, Gabriel. Gabriel's. Um, he got away with the, with the handball. Sometimes these things do come back to bite us, and they come back to bite us. They bite us in a big way. Um, like I said, um, it was his night, and he scored one. He could have had a chance to equalise again, from what I saw of the um, the, the, the repeat. These things are what makes a team gritty and hard and, and to be honest we was with them for, for quite a while as well we, we kept the pace Arteta um, from what I saw he, he didn't play um, Gabriel um, I think he's protecting him I think that's the I think that's the right move to make as well you know it's just a youngster we can't expect him to do everything and I know some of you guys will be saying, yeah, but some of the team players are youngsters as well. I saw two defenders going up for the same ball before it was um, Robinson scored the second goal. That's that's unforgivable. Uh, apparently, Bellerin um, his throw-ins were <laughs> illegal. <laughs> illegal throw-ins. I, I just don't, I, I don't get it. Anyway. Anyway, I'm not going to um, whinge. It's, it's a learning process. We're playing against them again on Thursday. So maybe there may be a few lessons learned. And maybe we may... We, we, from what I saw of the, of the match, we were there or thereabouts. It's just a couple of decisions and a couple of goals could have made the difference. So we go again. We go again against Liverpool again on Thursday and then we also got I believe um, Sheffield United at the weekend to me that's a more important um, match because it's points we drop points I think I think we deserve a, a draw I've been happy with a draw but it is what it is so this is going to be my face for the rest of the day <laughs> against these Liverpool fans I'm going to go into but you know what chin up and we move forward okay so if you like what we do if you like the videos if you like the comments uh, join us Alex is doing great work and Monty as well um, I can't say much more than that I'm, I'm a bit gutted but listen this is what it means to be an Arsenal fan you take the highs and sometimes you take the blows as well if you like what we do please subscribe to our channel um, we've got merchandise as well. Alex is doing um, a special membership as well, which um, he'll go into it on, on his videos. But 
This is Raz coming from Cardiff. Like, yeah, I'm a bit despondent, but listen, this is what we do. We are some fans. We just take it and we will give it back in spades, I hope. Raz coming from Cardiff, voice of reason. See you guys on the next video.